together with their combined efforts is how we can deal with information uh, needs of this crisis. For example, the Google created immediately a response center online, which is available on google.com slash crisis response slash Pakistan floods. And as part of this, they made available uh, satellite imagery of the, the, all the disaster hit areas. Secondly, they created a resource locator and the representative in Pakistan also extended the news that they had contributed $250,000 to, pro uh, to the relief efforts. Secondly, I would also like to mention that many other organizations, including the United Nations and so forth, have set up very, very important technical tools online on the internet in response to this. For example, uh, communities have gotten together to create local.com.pk, a website which provides up-to-date uh, satellite imagery. Um, a KMO files are available. Uh, af uh, they take snaps uh, every few uh, minutes. The Sahana uh, Sri Lankan Disaster Relief Management Project is already, the team is already in Pakistan. Um, there's Pakistan Flood Incident Reporting by Ushadi and CrowdMap. Now, interestingly, this project is from Africa. The SRSO relief activities in Upper Sindh are again being managed by Ushadi. And One Response Pakistan, they're also providing maps. The Relief Web, which comes uh, under the UN uh, Emergency Response, uh, is information for the humanitarian relief community. The UNOSAT, the Pakistan map products, again, UN produced maps of the situation. The Commons community has also stepped in by introducing the Crisis Commons Wiki for the Pakistan floods. ICT for Peace has, has added an inventory, uh, inventory wiki. And once again, I'd just like to thank everyone who's extending the, their support, and we still need your support.